Good morning, and welcome to my clavis. How are you feeling this morning? Are you feeling drained? Are you feeling sick? Are you feeling like your sinuses are out of control and allergies are going crazy? Are you feeling like your heart is broken or maybe other parts of your body or physically, emotionally, spiritually aren't right? How are you feeling today? Good morning and welcome to my clavis. This morning, I want to talk to you about who God uses to heal. I was doing some time studying the stories where Jesus was healing people and it caught my eye that he would say to people, your faith has made you well. He wasn't saying to people, I have healed you because I'm the son of God. I have healed you. He was saying, arise and walk. Your faith has made you well. Go your way rejoicing. Your faith has made you well. And so then I started thinking, though, also about the authority and the anointing that he carried. And I started putting these two together of when you have someone who is walking closely with the Lord and they have authority and they have anointing to see what the Father is doing and do it or to hear what the Father is telling them to do and do it. And then you have another person who has faith and expectation to be healed and you bring those two together, then psh, you get healing, you get restoration, you get an amazing miracle that takes place. And so people would bring the sick and they would bring all different people with needs, even just to fall under the shadow of the apostles and and just to be healed by the disciples. But it took that authority and anointing and great people of faith, but also the expectation and faith. So then I started thinking about ourselves today in our lives. And are we willing to come forward in humility and vulnerability and get prayed for with the expectation to be healed, with the expectation to be restored, with the expectation to see a miracle in our lives? And on the flip side, are we walking closely with the Lord so that we can move in authority and anointing for the purposes of God? So today, my friends, I want to encourage you to move forward in what God has for you. Because as you press into your relationship with him and you learn to hear his voice and obey it, your faith, your authority, and your anointing will grow. But also, as you move forward in humility with faith and expectation to see him move, he will not disappoint you because he is a faithful God. So, my friends, go your way rejoicing today, full of faith, because it is your faith that makes you well. Have a fantastic day, and God bless.